Really the key takeaway from my talk is that there's never been a time in the history of pharmaceutical marketing, there has never been a better time to create and distribute content for physicians because of the wondrous things that we can do utilizing our new technology. And whether that's augmented reality, virtual reality, or any of the other cool new technology that's come to market, it allows us to provide content to those physicians that is really customized, relevant, accurate, interactive, on demand, and some would say most importantly, it's fun and engaging for the physicians. So if we can create that great content, use empathy and emotion to get our points across, we can really make an even bigger impact on the lives of the patients and those physicians that serve those patients. When we think about how to wow those physicians, we think about two specific buckets. One, storytelling. How do we tell better, more engaging stories? And two, how do we create frictionless transaction and frictionless engagements with those HCPs? If we can do those two things, we can do a better job overall. When we think about the storytelling, how do we use augmented reality and virtual reality in new and novel ways to tell our stories? And interestingly, what we've seen in some recent analyses from VR platforms, we see that VR versus traditional learning of text-based documents creates two things. It creates one, empathy, and it creates action. And so if we can leverage empathy and action with our physicians, we have a better chance of them understanding what it's like to be that patient and to take action so that we can improve those patients' lives. And secondarily, when we think about the frictionless transactions, how can we deliver that information in a, in a more efficient way? So can we use things like chatbots? Can we use two-way on-demand video platforms to engage with those physicians? Can we use something like a virtual world with physicians where it's an avatar-based platform? So instead of traveling thousands of miles, users could create an avatar and have a simulation of all the types of engagements that they would have in the real world. So there's lots of types of ways that we can engage physicians, both with better content, better storytelling, as well as easier frictionless access to the content where we can educate the physicians and allow them to provide better care to their patients because they have all the relevant data at their fingertips. The key takeaway that I would say is embrace new technology, but not for the sake of technology. Content is king and content comes first. If we can think about ways to use the technology to empower the content, we can better engage the physicians and provide better outcomes for the patients.